Hello friends, this video on inverse trigonometric functions part 6 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching this video, please make sure that you have watched part 1 to part 5. Let's take the same thing for sec function. We have done for sine, cos and cosec. So we are doing now for sec function. For sec function, we know that the natural domain and range is, uh, the natural domain is any real number minus. 2n plus 1 pi by 2 form because for 2n plus 1 pi by 2 form the sec function become infinite and here the range is any real number that is not in minus 1 to 1 interval this part we know and this is the graph now to make this function as a, what you call invertible function what we can do is we, we again have to pick one uh, interval so if we pick the same interval minus pi by 2 to pi by 2 as we have done in the last thing, we see that this is not 1 over not 2. Why? Because for this value and this value, if you see, they are giving the same output. So it is not 1 over 1. So we can't take this interval. So if, but if we take this interval 0 to pi, so what we see, every value has a unique output. For every x, there is a unique y. Correct? But in this, we have to ignore this part, pi by 2, y. For pi by 2, it is not defined. So if we take the domain to 0 to pi, this one, minus pi by 2, then if you see, this becomes 1 over 1 function. With range, obviously, uh, any real number, but not minus 1 to 1, because this is a hollow portion. So if you see the restricted domain and range for the sec function was which we took is min, uh, 0 to pi but not minus but not pi by 2 and the range is any number minus 1 over. And if you just flip it to get sec inverse you get this one. Correct? Just flip it. So here the domain becomes any real number but not minus 1 to 1 and this becomes 0 to pi but not pi by 2. So here also if you see 0 to pi is a principal value branch correct 0 to pi is the principal value branch and the other branches are also possible for which this uh, uh, you get uh, uh, inverse function for example if you take pi to 2 pi obviously minus 3 by 2 pi here or you take this one 0 to minus pi minus pi by 2 pi here so these are all the branches for which the sec function is invertible but the one which we are interested in is the principal value branch that is 0 to 2 by minus pi by 2 because for pi by 2 the function is not defined. Here of the same thing y is equal to sec inverse x so we will get sec y is equal to x. Similar to this we can plot the graph so if we have y is equal to sec x graph like this the one which we have seen so we can get the y is equal to sec inverse graph just by flipping it, make x is equal to y and y is equal to x, you get this graph and this graph is nothing but y is equal to sec inverse x. Having done sec, thank you. Visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos, try free online tests, get the best quality study materials, study from the best tutors and mentors and much more. Thanks once again.